here we are waiting for the gas company to come and do their tie-in on this gas service line. Been waiting about three hours now since I sent in the service installation record. Uh, pulled a new one-inch poly through an old copper inserted steel line. There's the connection he got to make. Curb valve. They got this wrapped around here at the curb. And, uh, that's where he'll make his tie in. Because I still, I can't backfill until he gets here, so let's hope he gets here soon. Give you a shot of the inside. Show you the service head adapter. And the steel sleeve we installed. I installed just the one person company here so he has a new one inch plastic line all the way inside the building it's a two unit building here <sighs> gas meters got to stay up front due to the sidewalk can't impede traffic We have his old, his two gas meters here, his house line, and then we have the new plastic that is back in there with our tracer wire. This is the steel sleeve. This is the service head where the plastic pipe ties in at. There's a stiffener and the connection in here, perfection, style, corporation, then the Tracer wire is bonded to the steel with a clamp so that they could pick a signal all the way up at the curb valve from here. Trace this whole line. It's holding 90 pounds of pressure for the inspection. And once he gets here, we'll hook the house line back in to that service head adapter and we'll restore gas. We'll get his water tank and Boiler, well, one of these, the second floor uses a boiler and the first floor uses a furnace. Hmm. We'll get his water heater fired up because I believe only one unit is occupied. So yeah, new service line from the building to the street. 